Are you looking forward to it tomorrow night? Absolutely, yeah. yeah. Absolutely. The, Always. Uh, I suppose these are games where almost there, there's maybe a bit of freedom in terms of the optics of it. That people expect Rangers to come here and, and yeah. get a result. Yeah, there's a bit of a free hit, but I think the way the season's going, I don't think I think last season you could look at that, but I don't I don't really think they are really this season. I genuinely think it's games we think we can go and get results. Obviously, so. the fact that you know Celtic haven't been able to beat you in three attempts, you beat Rangers here at the start of the season. I think teams give you a bit more respect. Then. Um, I think they do, yeah, I think they do. But um, I think it's also you know when we start games well. Um, I think we were hard to play against when we got a bit of confidence as well, um, and we work hard. But I think that it's it's kind of up to us really. There's games where we've been a little bit sloppy as well. Uh, but I think if we if we were on if we were on the job, then we were very hard to play against. Obviously, you've, you've beaten Rangers here, you've beaten Celtic here. What do you need to get another result like that? Um, as I said, we just need to you know start the game, start the game confidently, um, and just work hard and just frustrate them. Um, be really disciplined off the ball, um, and then try and make the right decisions on the ball. How much of a role does belief play? You know, knowing that you can beat Rangers here, you've done it this season. Yes, it's a different team, different manager, but. Going out on that pitch and, and thinking and knowing that you can win that game, how imperative is that? It's huge. It's it's massive. It's um, it's even leading up to the game. You like you get excited. For sometimes like you you go into these games and when I first come up, boys are like oh god, you don't want to play against the big boys, so it can Rangers. But we actually want to play against them, you know, because um, we actually believe we can get results. So it's, it makes it so much better. And where does that mentality shift come from? Is that something the manager's been slowly trying to change in his time here? Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, and it's you know it's, it's, he wants the senior players to kind of push that as well um, in the dressing room. So I, I do my best, and there's, there's boys definitely pushing that just to believe that um, you know, especially if we want to finish where we want to finish this year, we, these are games we actually need to get results from. And in terms of the game on Saturday, just past there, not only a great performance and great result, but it felt like you had real control in the match. Is that something you've been working on too? Um, I, I said, not necessarily working on, I guess, because that because Saturday is just an epitome of just showing that. Um, if we run over, if we run over teams, our quality will always come out, um, and, and and I think that just showed in abundance on Saturday. So it's more that it, it's I truly believe it comes from the from the hard work first, and then everything will come from that. And I think at this point last season, 16 points worse off than you are now. Is that the best measure of your progress that you've made? Absolutely, yeah, for sure. And the clean sheets and the wins and 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 games where we'd maybe concede and um, and even you know lose or draw, we're winning them, seeing them out, or we're getting late goals ourselves. And from your perspective, does this feel like some of the best football you've played in your career? Um, yeah, I'd definitely say on the whole, for sure. You know, I, f I feel like I've been a little bit off it a um, couple of months, but uh, I definitely feel like this is the most free I've been able to play, um, and it's the most I've enjoyed my football for for a long time, for sure. And what do you put that down to? Oh, uh, a, a pit me thing that I've always said about the gaffer, just just letting me play my game. Um, and kind of you know giving me confidence, um, but also it's, it's, it's playing with his team. It's, it's, I, I really enjoy coming in and training with the boys. Um, so to go out there on a Saturday or, or, or on a Wednesday night and, and try and win a game of football with them is brilliant. Um, we've got such a good dressing room. It's such a good dressing room, um, and it just makes every day a pleasure for me. And I know it's a very different type of game that you have to, uh, tomorrow. What kind of challenge do you expect from Rangers? Well, they're, they're, it's very different, obviously, when we played them um, before. They're, now they've got a proper head of steam, they're, they're playing really well. Um, it's going to be a tough game. Like every, I always say every game in the SPL is tough, it really is. Um, and every, every team poses different challenges. Uh, they're going to want to keep the ball, they're going to want to move us around tomorrow. Um, it's, just, it's just us to frustrate them and, and, play, and play our way um, and make good decisions on the ball. Um, but they, look, we know, we know how good they are. Um, and they're in a really good place at the minute, so it's, it's, it's a bit about them, but it's mainly about us. Can I ask, what's the, the mood in the dressing room? And you know, a good result on Saturday against coming up the, the league leaders at the moment. What's the mood in the, is there a confidence about the lads? Or? There's been a confidence all season, even even games when we've lost, um, when, we've, when we've not played so well, there's been a, we come in the next day um, and everyone's happy to see each other, we're bouncing. Um, we're not dwelling on things too much. We, look, we're not happy to lose and, and not pick up results, but we know that what we'll do, we'll, we'll always put it right. So the mood's been brilliant the whole season. And are you hoping for, you know, a, a decent crowd? You know, the Kelly fans Wednesday night under the lights. So like, you hope for them to come back. Yeah, boys? yeah, yeah. And they were brilliant on Saturday. Um, and you know, it, it, it's, it's up to us to to make them sing sing, sing the songs um, by our output. So yeah, but if, uh, look, we always love playing in front of the fans.